Can anyone stop the unbeaten Treaty of Versailles for Paul Rhodes? One of his favorites. She is unbeaten in three starts. The winner of the English Oaks, the Cheshire Oaks, and a winner in the Maiden. So three for three thus far. Will it be the upstart youngster lost at sea for Stephen Rand? A winner at first asking in the Ribblesdale during Royal Ascot. Or will it be Jenna Lee getting back to a distance she is familiar with? Uh, after cutting back in distance from her fifth in the Queen's Vase, was a winner of the Welsh St. Ledger. Saint Ledger. 11 in line here in the Darley Irish Oaks, led by Treaty of Versailles. Three year old fillies in line. And away they go in the Darley Irish Oaks. Away quick and early was Soap Opera, and Soap Opera in the red and yellow silks and pants is away early and quick. Mossy's out there as well with Mossy Elliott. So Mossy and Mossy Elliott, of course they're up front. The two of them are very quick with Soap Opera. So Soap Opera leading by about a head over Mossy Elliott. Then it's Mossy and Jenna Lee. Jungle Queens behind them, then Treaty of Versailles, and 101 Bada Bing. Stone Chat is next, then Yunge Upzana and Lights and Sirens. With Lost at Sea, our trailer. So Soap Opera and Mossy Elliott quickening the pace. The two of them dueling it out on the front end. Yeah, one, two with basically nothing between them. Maybe a whisper or two as Mossy Elliott and Soap Opera dodge back and forth. Then we got about five or six lengths back to 101 Bada Bang and Mossy. And then on the rail is Treaty of Versailles. Stone Chats behind them on the outside with Jenna Lee. Finding some running room is Yungay Upzana and Jungle Queen. And then it's Lights and Sirens in the trailer. Lost to see as we enter in six and a half furlongs to go. So it's Soap Opera just ahead of Mossy Elliott. The two of them have been quick throughout. And they're about two lengths up over Treaty of Versailles, our favorite. As she goes uh, well back, it's 101 about a bing and Mossy moving up on the outside. Here goes Stone Chat and trying to find some room on the rail. There's Treaty of Versailles and like a rocket, she's off and in the lead. Treaty of Versailles starts to open up on them and now Treaty of Versailles is our new leader. But Soap Opera has a little bit of things to say about that. Soap Opera is trying to cry her way to the lead but Treaty of Versailles holding tough. Now on the outside, Mossy Elliott's moving well as is Soap Opera as they take the lead over from Treaty of Versailles. Could Treaty of Versailles move too quick here in the Irish dirt, uh, Irish Oaks? We shall see. It's so popper on top. Treaty of Versailles bounce back, but here is Mossy on the outside. It's Treaty of Versailles just over Mossy and Soap Opera. Yunge Epson is there as well, but Treaty of Versailles now opening up on the field with two furlongs to go. Treaty of Versailles putting a smack on them here. Yunge Upzan is closing in, but still about a length away. A half a furlong to go. Treaty of Versailles holding tough and is all out. Yunge Upzan not going to get to her today. Treaty of Versailles will win the Darley Irish Oaks 4-4-4 four, four, four for Paul Rhodes. She clinches both Oaks. A beautiful win for Treaty of Versailles. She put the stamp on this field.